508 now, time now for your morning headlines. Right now, travelers are waking up to fully restored flight operations as the FAA lifted those shutdown related restrictions on commercial flights. Now, the change took effect just moments ago at 5 o'clock this morning. Those restrictions were put in place to relieve pressure on air traffic controllers who had been working without pay throughout the government shutdown. The FAA had rolled back the air traffic cuts at 40 major airports all over the country to just 3% over the weekend. Meanwhile, AAA predicts that nearly 82 million Americans will travel at least 50 miles from their home this Thanksgiving. Nearly 90% of those traveling are expected to hit the road, though AAA says that number could change with the FAA announcing an end to its shutdown related order to reduce flights. As of right now, more than 6 million Americans are expected to fly this Thanksgiving. And the Ford Motor Company has unveiled its new high tech world headquarters building in Dearborn, Michigan. The roughly 2 million square foot structure has offices, design studios, even a food hall with seven restaurants. Talk about fancy, right? It sits just three miles away from the company's old headquarters, which will eventually be demolished now. Ford hasn't said how much the new building will cost, though the car maker is expected to finish its move there by 2027. And for the first time, astronomers say they've spotted a massive explosion from a star way beyond our solar system. This blast came from a red dwarf star about 130 light years away. Short flight, right? And researchers say it was tens of thousands of times stronger than anything the sun can produce. Scientists warn such eruptions could even strip the atmosphere from nearby planets. They now plan to study how often these violent blasts happen around other stars.